Grandpa Bill, Grandpa Bill, story time with Grandpa Bill. It's Grandpa Bill's story time. Yay! Hi, I'm Grandpa Bill. Welcome to Grandpa Bill's story time. Come on in, make yourself comfortable, and we're going to sit down and read a good book. Okay, today's book is Bear's Busy Year, a book about seasons by Marsha Leonard, pictures by Barry Weissman. Okay. Started. Here we go. Once there was the bear who was always busy. Oh, he's playing with trucks and toys. In all four seasons and all kinds of weather, he liked to be outside doing something. Oh, he's very busy playing the sidewalk with chalk and he's roller skating. It looks like he's having fun. In spring, when the sky was rainy and gray, the bear put on a raincoat, a rain hat, and a pair of boots. And then he hurried outside to splash in the puddles and squish in the mud. <laughs> Do you ever have fun in the rain? It can be fun. And when the rain clouds blew away, he went out into the garden to look at all the green growing things. There's flowers, there's plants in the garden like carrots and tomatoes. Nice, look at the sun trying to peek out. In summer, when the sun was hot and bright, the bear put on a t-shirt shorts, sandals, and sunglasses. Then he raced outside to build a city in his sandbox. Aw, oh, looks like fun, working with trucks and shovels and buckets. And when the days grew very hot and muggy, he ran through the sprinkler and waited in his pool. Ah, oh, that's fun, the sprinkler sprays the water, you jump in your pool, looks like his parents are working over there. In fall, when the air turned cool and crisp, the bear put on a flannel shirt, corduroy pants, and a jacket. Then he skipped outside to help his parents pick apples and pumpkins and squash. Yeah, things you do in the fall. And when the wind whooshed through the trees, he played tag with the leaves falling, <laughs> the falling leaves. Wee whoosh. In winter, when frost made patterns on the window, the bear put on a snowsuit, boots, stocking cap, and mittens. Gotta be warm. Then he rushed outside to catch the first flakes of snow. Oh, Sometimes you can catch snow on your tongue, right? You ever do that? And when the snow was deep on the ground, he went sledding with his friends. Yay! That's always fun. In all four seasons and all kinds of weather, the little bear liked to be outside. But sometimes in winter, when the air was very cold and the days were very short, he stayed inside. Then he curled up in his favorite chair and thought about all the wonderful things he could do when the next busy year began. Oh, always thinking about spring and then summer and then fall and then winter. Goodbye. Bye, Bear. What a nice little book. The busy, Bear's Busy Year. Thank you for sharing this book with me today. Come back again for more stories with Grandpa Bill. Goodbye.